Hello, Governor. Thanks for watching Segment 2. This is Mac Talk. I'm Tony Gagliano. I'm Sean Adams. I want to talk about soccer, football for the Americans. A little bit of footy in the conversation. The first thing I want to talk about was something that was tragic today. Tragedy struck Liverpool. It struck. They were up 3 to 0. Sturridge scored, Suarez scored. They, everything was going right for Liverpool and their title hopes. And then Crystal Palace decided to wake up in the 77th minute. And they tied the game, three to three. Steven Gerrard, poor lad, poor lad. He's crying, he's crying hard. He ran out of tissue. He ran out of tissue at the Gerrard, Gerrard residence. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. Man City now holds, what I'm stopping this stuff. <laughs> Man City now holds their own destiny in the title race. And for those of you guys that don't know, I call Man City to win the league. Yeah. Just gonna say, they did. Put it out there. Call Man City to win the league. Uh, they play, and they're, they're gonna win the league. They play Aston Villa, I think, Wednesday, and West Ham on Sunday, the final game of the season. And if they win those two games, the title's theirs. Uh, they'd have to slip up one of those games. Yeah, it's not gonna happen. Mm-hmm. No I would say they're more in danger of Aston Villa than they are West Ham. I'm not too sure about I'm that. Not, I'm not saying that there's danger like you're going through the forest, you don't got a gun, the bear shows up in danger. More or less like you're going through the forest, you don't have a gun, you've got a grenade when the bear shows up. You know, like <laughs> they're kind of in danger, but not really. Uh, so yeah, Man City's in first place now because Liverpool, well, Liverpool's in first place because they're completing one point. Yeah, 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 Man City's going to make up the game Wednesday and they'll probably win. Um, I was happy because Chelsea drew the Norwich 0 0. Uh, Chelsea's now out of the title race. And in fact, I was talking about this with my boss. I have wanted to see this for the last couple of weeks. Chelsea out of the title race and out of, uh, out of Chan- Champions League. I love nothing more to see that. Um, yeah, because it keeps Arsenal in Champions League. Yeah, it keeps that. Arsenal has now secured fourth place with the Everton loss to Man City. That's how Man City took their destiny. Um, they kind of a crazy game. That's in one three two. Let's stop real quick. Let's talk about that game. Edin Zeka fakes an injury <laughs> for seven minutes from 80th minute to 87th minute. Yeah, man. The referee yeah. is having a standoff and telling him to get up, get up, get up. And he's sitting there and he even stops the stretcher from coming out and coming to get him or whatever with his head injury. Because obviously with a head injury you can't walk and tell him to get up and walk. Oh, I would have tried. Well, maybe he doesn't speak good. Maybe that referee didn't speak English at all because he didn't <laughs> look like he spoke English. Uh, but seven minutes, and then there was two goals in the second half, and all plus all the other stops, out of bounds, goal kicks, all that kind of crap. Uh, they only gave five extra minutes, and Everton almost scored again to make their draw, but they, they failed. And, and with that loss, Arsenal secured fourth place. Uh, with the Chelsea draw, however, Arsenal came back with third. But Arsenal has now consecutive appearances in the Champions League, 18 consecutive appearances. They have never not qualified for the Champions, Champions League. Oh, God, it's that you do a diehard playoff round. You don't make any signings until like the last day. Uh, but we do have the FA Cup final coming up on May 17th against Hull City, That's easy. which is a, well, Birmingham City in 2010 was supposed to be an easy win too. We lost that game. Bradford City in the penalty shootout. Uh, yeah. In the Capital One's out by Jack. Trophy drought, nine years. This would be nice to end it. Um, I, I hope we do. Um, also, Fulham. Yeah. 13 years in the Premier League. Not even going. Oh, by the way, they took down the Michael Jackson statue at the beginning of the year. And now we just got to beat it. <laughs> that is the worst analogy ever, <laughs> uh, metaphor ever. Okay, the bullet's going down, champion, uh, uh, more championship. Throw uh, more throw it. <laughs>
I'm seeing Wigan back in the Premier League. Nah, not a chance. Owen Croyle, their coach, QPR is, awesome. is too strong. QPR doesn't so, have anybody anymore. They got rid of Julio Cesar. They got Bernero. He's coming back from loan. Uh, they got nobody. Yeah, Remy's coming back. Remy, he, yeah, he doesn't get to play in the games. He doesn't get to play in the. No. Oh, okay. Well, they're, they're, they're well, they got a lot of players on loan. They got a quality, quality roster. Ro- roster. Yeah. yeah. Although, if, if, what does Wigan have? How are you gonna back Wigan? Did Wigan beat Man City twice. I don't care. Anyways, Owen Corner, the coach, is your coach. If if QPR does make it back to the Premier League, it'll be the first time in Premier League history that they've had six one teams. Wow. Because Crystal Palace is gonna maintain the Fulham being relegated. But QPR will have six one teams. Um, also, Cardiff won and done in the Premier League. The other Welsh team, okay. they went up, they went down. I'm gonna blame their owner, their their Malaysian owner. He got on a flight, disappeared. Um, <laughs> that's so bad. <laughs> uh, I apologize to all the families. Oh the man, flight. that that's, that's, that's awful. Yeah, that is awful. But go, I mean, go to go to other. Go to other well, I'm just saying, Cardiff, Cardiff, Cardiff is gone. Get so out of here. Norwich is probably gonna be the other team. I also. Probably yeah. Awesome. yeah, yeah. So also Champions League. Now we have an All Madrid final. Real Madrid destroyed Pep Guardiola's Bayern Munich in Germany, four to zero. Yeah, four to zero. That's bad. That's really bad. Yeah. So they're going for La Decima, which will be their tenth European Cup. Um, it was five to zero in aggregate. That's Atletico upstaged Chelsea in London, three to one, to make it to their first ever Champions League final, which I love because in consecutive weeks Chelsea lost their first ever home game at Stamford Bridge under Jose Mourinho to Sunderland. Then they lost at home because they tried to park the bus. They were even up one to zero on a Fernando Torres goal, and they ended up losing that game at home. And then they drew to Norwich, which eliminate them out of the championship for their for their for the Premier League. So I was really happy on that. Um, Mid table, 
ninth or tenth, they're in Champions League. So that takes away the fourth spot no. in the EPL. No, it doesn't do that. It doesn't do that. The winner is automatically in regardless of how good the record is. Okay, so you can have five teams. It's only if they EPL. It's only no. Yeah, you could have five teams. The only Let's say Everton finished fourth and they won the final. Then they don't give it to some other country. Yes, yeah, yeah, some other country gets it. They, they don't. They I see. An extra so who do they take it away from then? Probably the lowest in the uh, FIFA ranking. Co -co Coefficients, yeah. 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 Okay. They just, all they do is they, they change the way the, the there's going to be more teams, one more team in the Champions League, and they'll do it like another, instead of going, you know, they have like, the Champions League starts like in August. Austrian team, yeah, yeah, yeah. Austrian, yeah, 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 stuff like that. So, so uh, also, last bit of news I want to say before we go: the World Cup is in 37. Get excited because we're gonna lose. Yeah, we are. Obviously. If you want to check out something cool, if you guys need some swim trunks, they're selling early selling United States and back all national teams are selling swim trunks of the team's uniform for World Cup. Yeah, I'll buy the first. Yeah, the board shorts are yeah. That is the ugliest USA uniform no, I've ever not. seen in could my it? life. Could that is could terrible. Yourself. That it is the awesome. worst thing I've ever seen. It looks in my like life. a Neapolitan ice cream. Yeah, basically. Yeah, Leo, thanks for watching Second Two SmackDown. Stay tuned for Second Two. Thank you, Dead Man. You better watch the bounce. Steven Gerrard is crying. He's on a